And in honor of Father's Day, we invited Ed Brown, super dad and owner of Restaurant 81 here in New York, to prepare some wonderful soft shell crabs. Beautiful. Ed's got some special guests with him this morning, too. In case you haven't seen, we have got uh, the two young men, 10-year-old Harry. Harry and 13-year-old Alec. Alec. Good morning, guys. Good to have you with us. And it looks like Harry's pretty good with a knife. Yeah, yeah. Not quite do they help you, Not so great for the soft shell He's <laughs> Not so good for the soft shell. These guys are great cooks. They help me a lot. Really? So and, uh, tell us about soft shell crabs. What are we making? Soft shell crabs. It's the time now. I'm just going to get these started while we're... Okay. Sorry. And now I've got some oil. <laughs> I've got a little oil. I'm going to put a little bacon. We're, gonna, we're making a pan roast. From a seasonal standpoint, is this the season for soft this shell? Is this is the time. Is a good time or a bad time? This is the time. As soon as the water starts getting warm, they start losing their shells. Go ahead, Harry. Throw those in. Oh boy, Harry. Okay. We've got a little garlic and some shallots. Harry, who does the cooking at home? Who does um, mostly my mom does. Oh, the truth is out. She's a good cook. We got Harry working and, at the restaurant And um, for Father's Day, we have a little special coming to him. Oh, so. oh okay. So that's just a little that. tiny hint. We won't reveal what it okay. is. Okay. You know, you put bacon in anything and garlic, yeah. and, and it's, it's going to be a good, home right? run. It good. Bacon, shallots, garlic, crabs, and put a little vermouth uh -huh. or some white wine. Okay. Can you get soft shell crabs in any part of the country, pretty much? I mean, not um, fresh, but is it a thing you find in grocery stores? Yes, you can find them pretty much anywhere, uh, especially at this time of the year, and even fresh. Just a little milk there. fresh. This is uh, some half and half that I put in. Tabasco? Ta Tabasco, or your favorite hot sauce. This is a very New Orleans dish. I worked for a year in New Orleans. They make anything to a pan roast. Scallops, oysters, shrimp. Mm. Okay, so we've got Tabasco, Worcestershire, shallots, garlic in there. We're gonna get some fresh parsley and tarragon in there. A little bit of lemon juice, some brandy. How long does this take to cook all together? Well, you see us cooking it live when we're eating this before we go off the oh, air. Oh, really? Oh, Look yeah. how quick that is. Not bad. And we got about 30 seconds. A little gonna, salt. <laughs> we've also got, I made some soft shell crab club sandwiches. Wow. Uh, horseradish mayonnaise, crab, thick sliced bacon, tomatoes, and lettuce. Over here, I've sauteed some with dana dal, which is an Indian spice, kind of mm -hmm. like a lentil with spring vegetables. Alec, Alec over what here. Alec, what did you do? What are you making, It's beautiful. Alec? Um, strawberry shortcakes. Beautiful. He's making strawberry shortcakes with mascarpone cream, fresh strawberries, a little strawberry puree. These are farm strawberries. Um, and then the pan roast is coming up to speed here. And it's a soft shell crab, so you can actually eat the shell. Exactly. We can eat the shells. It's completely edible. Mm. We and make how long did it take to get the kids up to speed? You see, you got Harry's pretty good with a knife right now. You got Alex who's the your... Uh, the kids brought me up to speed pretty man. quick. <laughs> Alex the dessert man. And these guys come to the restaurant, so when you come to 81, you can see these guys there. Wonderful. The pan we roast got three for to, the price of one. The pan roast, we're actually about to put on our new grill menu that's going to be starting. Yeah. But I have soft shells at 81 in every possible style. So we're, we're looking at about three and a half and minutes for this whole thing. Yeah, Start really good. Let's eat. And then we have mojitos, so it's pretty perfect. Uh, we made we made a, a watermelon style of mojito called a wojito. Oh, beautiful. And Alec, Harry, thank you all so much. Happy Father's Day to thank you. Thank you very well much. Done, guys. Yeah. We're going to put day. the recipe on our newly redesigned website, earlyshow.cbsnews.com.